Hello YouTubers, this is Pukadichit here, and I'm glad enough to, uh, or happy to uh, share uh, to you for uh, more anime uh, stuffs. And before I begin uh, talking about this uh, event, I hope I hope you uh, bear with me because right now I'm still kind of tired because going to straight uh, two straight days for going to the event. So if I speak any vocabularies or some language whatsoever, I'm going to talk like a mistake. Do apologize because I'm really, really exhausted. Even my whole body can't move very well. So please do bury me while I'm talking about this. So before I continue this, uh, showing you this uh, event, this event is actually collaborated with the uh, ACGHK, and this is actually similar to Coming World and Rainbow Gala. So this is the second time that they show up, and I do appreciate for this event, but not for this one. For this one, I'm going to explain on my next video because I'm still disappointed. So I'm going to explain for next time. I don't want to explain today because it's just going to ruin my uh, mood for showing you this uh, video. So before I go to this one again, sorry, there's two uh, quick announcements I want to make. First of all, is this one, which is going to be the very first time, but I'm only going to go on, on the first day, on August, just to meet this person, uh, Mofuwa, to get her autograph on a meet and greet. Um, starting at 2.30 to uh, 7 p.m. right here. You can see right here. I don't know the uh, full information, so you can just check it out on the emacshk.com right here. Give you a few seconds to check it out. Because uh, they have like these kinds of uh, events. You can take uh, some, uh, uh, some signatures from your favorite artistas. And you can see some um, Japanese uh, singers that we were going to be uh, having their concerts there. I have no further details unless you check it out this because I just got this leaflet. And it's going to be at the EMAX area at Kowloon Bay here in Hong Kong. So put that away. And whoops, not this one. That's what I'm disappointed. <laughs> Sorry. And right here is the DG Monthly event or in separate form, a Digimon only event, which next Sunday I'm going to go and cosplay as Hikri Yagami based on a Digimon Adventure tree. And this, and you can go for this website to this web, uh, website to uh, get more further details, although it's going to be in Chinese. So if you have any uh, uh, questions that you don't know much about it or what they're going to have, etc., or you're not so sure because this is written uh, mo a lot in or most of it in Chinese. So you can also check it out on Facebook too. I already registered for the cosplay like that, so it's no problem for me. And it's gonna be held at Diamond Hill, like I mentioned. Then this is the website. Oops, sorry. Zoom that in. Right there. Since I'm holding my phone, so my hand's kinda of wobbly. Like that. So um, I'm just waiting for next Sunday so I can go to this event. So right now back to this one, since this is the booklet, the big booklet from the event, and this is held from the third floor, well this one was held on the first floor, same building, same location, at one chai. And this only held for two days, so you can see here at Hall 3C, at the third floor. So it held it uh, uh, yesterday and today, it's the same like uh, last year, that they only held for two days. So I'm not going to show you everything right here which people sells their own artworks like that and sell them. It's similar to, like I mentioned, uh, Comic World and Rainbow Gala. So what are the items I bought? Here they are. And most of it are like um, Big Hero 6, Digimon, and uh, Pokemon. So before, so I'm going to show you one by one and very quick. Right here is the same from the brand, uh, I mean company, uh, from Pokebox. So this is one of the one of the eight or seven keychains of the Eevee Evolutions. There's simply Kawaii. You can see purporting right here. My hands shaking again. Sorry. If you can see the tail now, this time is uh, like shaking like that when you're moving. You can see it's moving. It's really nice. I love I love it so much. But what thing there at their boot that I regret, or I should say that I don't have enough budget to buy, is the bag. It costs like uh 120, but it's similar to the other bag that I have, so no point. It costs 120 but it's still nice. But if you want to check more stuff from them, uh, or you want to uh, order stuff from them, 
you can just go to their website which you can check it on my other last year's video that I previewed the terror uh, the tarot cards if you can recall that one or if you did seen it like that so please go to the websites maybe it's there if it's not there then you might need to wait for some months like that so I can't give you any further details so for a second now I'm gonna show you Digimon Right here is the postcard of the cosplayer, cosplay as uh, Angel Woman, and she's the one. Actually, I saw this photo from the world, uh, from the world cosplay, and I was really surprised to uh, see this photo. So I asked this person, "Was it you that you cosplay this?" And she said she was, and I was happy to get her uh, autograph right here. And I thought maybe she's from other other country like that because I couldn't see or know this uh, background location like like I never knew so I was happy to take a selfie with her but in another uh, she was in another outfit so I was just happy to get her autograph that's it so if you did see this uh, this pic from other websites or world cosplay this is this uh, she's the one and then right here is another pin a collection which I got so many ready to be honest this time I got uh, Takaru and Hikari, or the shipping name uh, Takari. I'm so happy to see this. And the seller uh, was hoping to uh, see me again on August 2nd since they're going to be there. And like I mentioned, I'm going to cosplay as Hikari. So that's why I got this one since I don't have it. Put these guys away. And last of all, going to the big uh, theme is the Big Hero 6. So first one I got is right here is the um the cup mug uh stand or should I say holder like that is on the chibi uh the 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 Himada I mean uh Hamada fa the family like that the brothers sorry I'm talking weird again because I'm still tired it's so kawaii I couldn't stand it so I had to buy it and it costs ten Hong Kong dollars so it's cheap. Even this one costs ten dollars. It's like a memo pad like that. You can write on it, but I don't know what to write on it, so I'm just gonna leave it like this until maybe it's the right moment to use it. And last of all, oops, uh, let's just put these guys right here, so it do not cause any uh, mess. And of course, last of all is the stickers. Cost twelve Hong Kong dollars. Right here you see Bicker Six variety of Baymax and Hero. And some weird stuff, something like inflatable uh, Baymax, hugging uh, some spiky stuff such as the fish, the durian, and the cactus. And then one Tadashi, which is why you should put more Tadashis like that. And then you see variety of Baymax doing some weird stuff like that. Even the low battery, I find it uh, very <laughs> hilarious. And here's the um, the the Megabot. I was about to say uh. The the microbot, sorry. Even right here, I couldn't resist this one. It's very cute. They even have the bag version of this one in Korea, which I love it so much, but I couldn't get it. And the memory chip, uh, that's put in, of course, in Baymax. So it's really cute. So in general, or in conclusion, it's really nice. It's really nice that they have this event. Without it, it's gonna be so freaking darn. Uh, uh, boring and disappointment for the event. So for the disappointment for the Anycom event, I'm going to explain more about it on my next video and I will explain why I was disappointed and pin out what they must improve for next year and hopefully they could improve, improve it. If not, then I might end up sticking to this uh, creative paradise, which I support this one. And since they started, it's still not yet like really like professional like that. So I still fully support for this creative paradise, and I hope they will continue this for next year for the Anicom. In case if this Anicom is not interesting enough, I'm willing to go to the upper floor just to go to this one. So thank you guys for watching for this very quick video, and stay tuned for my uh, my thoughts on the for the ACGHK or Anicom event. That I'm going to point out the stuff that I don't like about it. So uh, stay tuned for that. Thanks for watching.